What's up? It's your girl Reese and welcome back to my space. If you're new here, welcome. We talk all things work, style, fashion, and beauty. And if you're old, thank you for rocking with me for another week. Today, unfortunately, it's still winter, so we're gonna keep talking about winter. Um, I don't think the groundhog saw its shadow and I'm kind of disappointed because I'm ready for like some warmth. But we're gonna talk about one of my favorite topics, winter coats, and specifically, Winter coats that never, ever, ever go out of style. Um, I s have started collecting winter coats, I think I got three, three years ago now. Yeah. Uh, so every year I try to purchase a new, higher quality winter coat that will last me forever. So we're gonna go through some of the winter coat styles that you can keep in your closet literally for the rest of your life. As long as you maintain it, you know, dry clean them, get good quality products, you can keep these babies forever. They will never go out of style, honey. You're not wasting money. So five winter coats that everybody needs in their closet. One, a wrap coat. A wrap coat, why? Because it's so elegant. Honestly, just the most elegant piece and simple. It's so simple to throw on and throw off because there's no buttons, you're not searching for things, you're not trying to put a zipper in at the bottom. It's very, very simple. Put it on, wrap it, tie it, done. And the extra wrapping or layering part at the front gives you that extra frontal warmth. So it's given, it's a, it's a, it's a win-win situation. Um, these coats uh, I find do best in your closet if it's like a neutral color. So my suggestion, black, beige, gray, brown, cream, can't go wrong, will live forever. Number two on the docket is the peacoat. Can't go wrong with the peacoat. Peacoat to me is the perfect day to night coat. It looks super professional at work. It looks like you came to do the business. You mean business, we're gonna close the case, we're gonna close the sale, we are gonna whatever you do for business. But also it is the perfect elegant touch to your evening wear. Um, and it's warm. I mean, pea coats are typically wool, uh, but now go come in an array of fabrics, but I still try to gravitate towards the wool because it lasts long. Um, and it comes in all shapes and sizes. So just like the belted wrap coat, I suggest getting these in all types of colors, but sticking to neutrals or plaids. Like I have a plaid one here. I also have a beige one. Um, and I love it. it. The plaid one is a little more our business for me. Like I wear it to work. Um, the beige is more day to night. Uh, I don't typically wear my plaid peacoat out at night, um, but I guess I could. I guess I could totally wear that. Um, yeah. On to number three, the puffer coats. So I have a lot of feels about a puffer parka coat. I used to buy the ones with like the fur trim on the hood with the big Canada Goose logo or the Macage logo, which I still love. I think it serves a purpose, but I think they're a little too casual. And though they will last forever in your closet, I really like a piece that is a little more diverse. And I have found that the puffer coat that is a solid color with minimal logo is so chic like it can be so casual with a pair of uggs or it could be worn with like a pair of boots and look great so um puffer is a must because it's warm but also buy a puffer that is minimal logo and solid color so that you can wear it with more things and be dressy and casual um on to number four number four is just a trench coat um and a trench coat is something you need for all seasons. Trench coats are just a fashion staple. And a winter trench coat, I would suggest a maxi trench coat. Elite, elitist. You literally do the most minimal stuff underneath. Like I wear all black, put my hair in a low bun and put on big sunglasses and throw on my trench coat and I look like I tried the hardest and so expensive. It's literally the one of the chicest final touches you can put to an outfit. I debate me. You won't win. You just, it, it's factual, buy trench coats, period. There's, period. I don't need to give you reasons to buy a trench coat, just buy a trench coat. You will not regret buying a trench coat. Okay, <laughs> moving on. I'm obviously passionate about this. Number five on the docket that will never ever go out of style is a fur or faux fur, whatever. Floats your boat, whatever you like. Um, 
faux furs or furs come in all shapes and sizes the long ones the short ones vests whatever all of them <laughs> it's never gonna go out of style we have you go to a vintage thrift shop or whatever you still you still find uh, fur coats from ladies that had them in like the 60s where you would go pick like a piece of fur felt and it would turn it into a coat and then you could sign the inside of your coat you can still find those like and they're still going for over a grand it's wild it's wild but that's how you know it's forever so why buy a fur coat because you look expensive and if you guys are on my channel you guys know that we're trying to look expensive honey without always spending a lot of money but like yeah this fur coat that i have here is my shorter faux fur uh, it looks good though right for a faux fur it looks really really good the colors are perfect and you i mean like you walk into a place in your fur coat and you're like I've arrived and everyone turns their head and they're like, who does she think she is? And I'm like, that bitch, honey, that's who I think I am. So, I mean, doesn't everyone want to enter a room like that? No, just me? Okay. <laughs> so, yeah, you need a fur coat because bad and bougie vibe, Joanne the Scammer vibes, you look expensive as hell. Do it, you won't regret it. So, that's it for me. Those are the five winter coats that I think everybody needs in their wardrobe that will last forever so long as you take care of them dry clean your coats um, and invest in good pieces of clothing so I don't buy all of these things at once because then I would be poor I try to buy one good coat a year and I wait for sale season and so since I have a collection now I don't have to buy them at the beginning of the season when they're a bajillion dollars I can wait until they're a bajillion dollars minus 80 <laughs> percent i hope you enjoyed the video i hope you guys got some inspo and if you liked it don't forget to give me a thumbs up and i will see you guys next week